Dark Samus has made the leap from assist trophy to fighter. Who else can? There are several assist trophies that would be really awesome to see as a playable fighter. Especially Chain Chomp! I mean, he's already in Mario Tennis, so why not just Smash Brothers? This is my list of 5 assist trophies who could become fighters. This is just my opinion, please respect it if your opinion differs. Anyways, let's get into this. The chairs, Sakurai! The chairs! Oh, Majora's Mask, my favorite game of all time. Of course Skull Kid's on this list. I may or may not have voted for him numerous times in the Smash Ballad. I never believed that Skull Kid ever had an actual chance until now. With the whole villain's theme going on, Young Link returning, Majora's Mask getting a remake, his assist trophy still missing in action, and having the moon as an assist trophy potentially replacing him, I am pretty suspicious and hopeful. I would die if he got in. Skull Kid has been a pretty heavily requested character for many years. I always thought Minna would make it in before Skull Kid, but she's already confirmed as an assist trophy. I'm beginning to think that Sakurai just hates Twilight Princess. I'm going to hold on hope for him making it in until we see an assist trophy or a character reveal. Just know I'll be crying in the club if he gets revealed as a fighter. The Mayor's Right Hand Pup, Isabel. Isabel recently appeared on my previous top 5 Echo Fighters for Smash, so putting her on this list shows how much I really want her in. Whether she does make it into Smash as an Echo or an original fighter, it'd be great to have more Animal Crossing representation considering how large the franchise is. With Cap'n taking up Uber, the chances for Isabel seem larger. He's less cute, but he's very reliable, let me tell you, 5 stars from my boy Cap'n. What kind of heartless person wouldn't want Isabelle in Smash? She's so cute and adorable! I love her! Obligatory Shadow the Hedgehog list placement. If I were to gamble and put my money on any assist trophy making it in, it'd be Shadow. He's a clone of Sonic, he plays similarly to Sonic in certain games, and Sakurai wouldn't have to make a whole new moveset based around guns and chaos control. So he could be an easy echo. He's a villain slash anti-hero, depends on the game. His assist trophy is missing and Knuckles has become an assist trophy, and he's Shadow. Him getting into Smash is every Sonic fan's wet dream. Honestly, I would have died if he got in back when I was a huge Sonic fan. If he does get in though, we better get Radical Highway as a stage. Before we begin, I want it to be known that I have zero knowledge of Sin and Punishment. Whenever I first got Saki and Brawl through an assist trophy, my interest was piqued. I never touched a Sin and Punishment game, but I learned about Saki and the series through Smash. And I think that's very similar for many. Having not yet appeared as an assist trophy is odd because Saki was kind of a standout assist trophy in both Brawl and Smash 4. He was one of the more well-known ones. Could Saki actually have a chance? Maybe. Sin Punishment isn't relevant anymore, but the fanbase grew because of Smash. And if the fans have been loud enough, Sakurai may have heard them, especially in the Smash Bell. Or Sakurai may have a special likeness for Sin and Punishment himself. There isn't much solid proof or evidence that Saki actually has a chance. In fact, on this list, he seems the least likely. But for some reason, I have a strange feeling that it could just happen. Who knows with this game? We got Ridley and K. Rule. Like, it's insanity! Golden Sun is dead, get over it! Yeah, Golden Sun is dead, that's very true. But that doesn't mean Isaac's chances are slim. When Golden Sun was alive, it was huge. Selling a bit over a million and a half 
copies, which was insane for a new series back in the Game Boy Advance days. And the fans are evidence of the game's success. Back in the Brawl days, you couldn't go anywhere Smash-related online without seeing love for Isaac, or people wanting him to be playable. I consider Isaac, Gino, and Ridley the three big characters that people really wanted in Smash back in 2008, 10 years ago. The outcry for Isaac has been large and is once again growing immensely. Seeing him brought up in forum posts is giving me nostalgia of the days before Brawl came out. I think it could finally be Isaac's time to shine. But to counter my point, Isaac wasn't in Smash 4 as an assist trophy, only a brawl. So him not yet showing up as an assist trophy could simply mean he once again isn't in the game at all. And all Sakurai will do is just add another Golden Sun song to please the Golden Sun fans. And on top of all of that, Golden Sun seems to be a pretty dead series, despite Golden Sun 3 having a massive cliffhanger. If Isaac actually does get into Smash, it could revitalize the series, which would make thousands and thousands of people very happy. I could do an entire video on Isaac if I wanted to. I really want him in Smash, and I never thought I would say that. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and leave a comment saying which assist trophy you would like to see become a fighter. Thank you again for watching, and I'll see you all later.